Hello, hola, and bonjour, everybody. This is Doug. And Matthew. From Macrobro's Bodybuilding. MD30. And the reason why I'm making this video, even though it might seem pretty random, is if you look right now, we're doing cable curls <laughs> off of a uh, lat pull down. And we're in the basement, obviously, like we said before. And all I'm saying is, is you gotta work with, you, with what you have and be innovative. We're hitting buys right now. We don't have any cables besides this. So we put a little handle on there and lay back and it actually really works. Well, so. I'm feeling it. Oh yeah. Yeah, we've been doing this. This is this is our bread and butter. We've done this thing for years before we got to yeah. actually go to a real gym. So we were working out in the basement for like two years before we even went to a gym. Exactly. We didn't even go to a gym like a year from our first contest, we had never stepped into a gym. <laughs> Seriously. I mean, it was like half a year in the gym before our first bodybuilding competition. So, like, definitely don't have oh. to have a gym membership, as long as you get some stuff. Exactly. I remember <laughs> I remember on our first uh, little application for our uh, competition, it said, like, where's your gym? And they didn't announce it. We almost put the basement. <laughs> <laughs> we should have done that, because they did announce the gym. That would have been funny. Oh. Anyway, guys. I hope you like this little short video. Yep. Speaking, uh, of, that, oh, speaking of that, you can like this video. Yeah, throw it out a comment. And even subscribe. Or remember, there's always more on the way. So, <laughs> <laughs> that's your line. Stay true. Does height have anything to do with how hard uh, a movement is, like a different lifting movement, or height gives any kind of advantage while posing in a bodybuilding routine or something like that? Now, this is a.